Hey everyone, thanks for stopping by the Standards Weekly Check-In. I'm Colin, behind the camera we got Heavy Metal Dylan. What's up? Today we're going to be getting into some staff picks, looking through some new arrivals, then some recently priced records, and addressing some viewer questions at the end of the video. As always, if you see anything you like, you can stop by the shop, give us a ring, or hit the DMs on Instagram where we're open to selling records. It's like, that's what we do here. You know what I mean? Also, last time to, to hype this shirt, I shouldn't say last time, I might do it again. Yeah. I'm a wild card, bro. Mm -hmm. We only have sizes XL and 2XL left. We sold through almost uh, half of the tees. Big folk. Here you go. Hey, your, your time has come. We got XLs, we got 2XLs. We're here to party. Uh, it's on the big cartel. It's in the store. Oh yeah, we're open 11 to 8, seven days a week. That's the part I forgot. What are you listening to, Dylan? <laughs> what am I listening to? Yeah. All right, we got an uh, Ice Spice EP, Like. Um, amazing six song EP. Listen to it all day today. It's amazing. Why didn't you say it right then? Like. Like. It's, it's hard to say it. Yeah, I know. I, I was listening to the Ice Spice's Like. Yeah, I'm listening to the new Ice Spice EP, Like. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's kind of weird to say. Yeah. I'm not used to saying I would. You know what I'm jealous of? Hmm. When she goes, Grah. I wish I could do that right. Oh. You just heard the best one I've ever done, and it's very bad. <laughs> I'm not going to attempt because I feel I like know. <laughs> you're, it's going to mess me up. <laughs> no, it's so, it's, so, it's so cool. Yeah. I like, I, 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 I really like that EP too. Yeah. Yeah. Great EP. It's a little bit like you're in a Zoomie. Not a Zoomie. No. Uh, uh, what's uh, the jewelry one? Claire's? Claire's? Yeah. A little bit like more You feel like, like Claire's. you're in Claire's? Yeah. What's in there? Another one like icing or something? Oh, Frosting. Justice. Justice. But I think that's like Justice, like little girls. I don't think they're listening okay. to Ice Spice in there. Uh, nah, not Ice Spice. No. Ice Spice is too extreme, I think. Kanye West little kids like them. She, they, they tricked her to come over, remember? <laughs> yeah, that was sick. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Like in I, the beginning of her popularity. Yeah, that was like, she was like, shit, okay, I'll go over. And yeah. yeah. Kim Kardashian and Kanye West kids. <laughs> Awesome. So cool. Uh, yeah, no, it's very, I, I don't know what it is about her music. It's very, you can't, it doesn't take itself too seriously. Mm -hmm. You just you just listen to it and you smile. You know what I mean? I do be smiling when I listen to Ice Spice. Yeah, it's fun. It is yeah. fun, silly music. Mm -hmm. A lot of, some of this pop music that comes out, I'm like, ah, oh, geez, I have to I do, I do this, you know? Yeah. I start thinking about, it. hmm, the socioeconomic implications of this beat. And uh, no, no, you don't do that with Ice Spice. It's just... Listen. Yeah, have a good time. Yeah, right? of course. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> if I was bitches, I'd hate me too. Who, if the party's not lit, why would I go? Exactly, that's what I'm saying. Anyway, what are you listening to? The, the, a, a very unlit party, let me tell you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's pretty lit. It's moderately lit. Yeah. The two um, uh, Atheist albums, are, they reissued. This band is uh, great. If you have any interest in, I would go as far as say if you have any interest in progressive rock or technical death metal, Jazz fusion. If you're a big brain, if you're you got a big brain and you're like, I want some, I want, I'm, I'm interested in this metal stuff, but I don't want to like, you know, don't give me a Slayer record. Yeah. I don't want to listen. You can't. Someone with a galaxy brain, you can't start them with Creator. Mm -hmm. Give them something that's gonna engage. Those two atheist records, perfect. Early, early, early progressive and technical death metal is like the coolest shit ever. Ever. Best genre of music. And this is the atheists are about as good as it gets. You see that one? This is the second record, right? Yeah. Damn. So cool. I haven't seen it in a while. Legends. Yeah. Legends. Uh, should we look through some records? Sure. Dylan, you've been on some genuinely chill ass shit lately. I'm trying. I was just thinking because you've been putting me on to this guy Jack Johnson. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I've been listening to a lot of just the yellow Jack Johnson record with the uh, Curious George song, Upside Down. It's fucked up that I'm starting to genuinely like the Jack Johnson songs that you play around. <laughs> I told you. Which you might just be doing as a prank, but it's working. Nah, it's good. I like He's, that Curious George song. It's a good song. It's, it's a, a great music video. It's, a, it's, then, it's such a good music video, it's turning me out of the song. I feel like, you know, 20 years later, <laughs> they could have never expected. <laughs> are we gonna Are we gonna watch the Curious George movie when it gets re-released? I can, I gotta work that day. Come on. I could give you a million guesses and you would never guess what I was listening to. While walking around Carlsbad Village, getting a little bit sunburned, which I'm kind of self-conscious about, just jamming out to one band, multiple albums. What band is it? Coldplay. No. Damn it. Badfinger. <laughs> I told you, a million guesses, you would never guess that. Yeah. I would have believed it I, at the shop if you were like, I was listening to Badfinger. No, today. it's not like, oh yeah, a copy of No Dice came in. Of course I'm going to throw it on. I love that record. Oh, the passion. Really but I was record. getting into... Uh, 
The first record, which still sucks, yeah. um, straight up is a fucking another 10 out of 10 record. Mm -hmm. Not as good as No Dice, but still a 10 out of 10. And um, the record that came after that, the one with the donkey on the cover. Oh, okay, yeah. That's a beautiful record. I swear I like, tried it and didn't care about it and then called it a day at some mm -hmm. point. And that was foolish of me. Pad Finger is so Dylan. Like that scene in uh, Billy Madison where he shakes the kid. Stay here. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm my like, face is being stretched back. Yeah, I'm doing that to you right now. Yeah. I'm just telling you, Bad Finger is good. Is good. <laughs> I never disagreed. I know. It's obviously, they're good, but man, they are, they're really good. Viewer questions. This is the part of the video where we answer the questions left on last week's YouTube comment section. Leading off uh, Going Underground, sitting us with a hell yeah, darkness. I had no idea what that is. I think it's because this is... Going underground, the yes. user. Yes. Works in mysterious ways. Yeah. Mind expanded. Uh huh. Doubled and reversed. Yeah. And I, I think it's because we were talking about the accept. <laughs> it has a song, Princess of the Dark. Okay. Again, I just like to see Going Underground in the, in the comments. So shout out to Going Underground, Bakersfield, LA, worldwide. <laughs> also, uh, Charles Shafai is asking us uh, uh, if what, a, a band we. we hate but most people seem to like we're usually a channel of love yes so it's not rare that we we have hate uh-huh might be too strong of a word yeah i'll say this i uh, lately i'm comfortable saying that i dislike pink floyd mm. entirely yeah i used to be kind of on the edge about it i was like oh moody blues that sucks or like you know certain groups that are just like a little too much pomp <laughs> You know, a little too much filler, a little too much air, a little too much middling around. Yeah. I was like, oh, Pink Floyd's not that. They're 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 different. They're doing it different. They do have moments. Yeah. But I think at this point, I'm like really looking at the totality of their work. It's like, oh yeah, there's a reason why people, or why I just like the first record and parts of Dark Side. There's no reason to think of them as higher than like, you know, Jethro Tull or some of that kind of real filler, filler music. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm officially casting my hat in. I might turn it around in a couple years. Might be five, ten years. Switch it back up. But for now, I, I think I'm uh, going with old Johnny Rotten of the Sex Pistols fame. Famously said, I hate Pink Floyd. Oh. <laughs> too deep? Yeah, no. Too I thought, deep? I'm, too, I'm too, going too punker fool on this one? No, I thought you straight up were like, and also fuck. No, I no. also do not like uh, Johnny Rotten. No, no. I was, but I'll, 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 never, I'll never disrespect the Sex Pistols. I get it. Or most of PIL stuff. Mm. Um. Honestly, we're gonna we're gonna be both hated. Go on. I tried my best, even as a youth. Tried my best to like the Who. Oh yeah. Can't do it. Like I, I can watch it when right. I have visuals for Pinball Wizard the movie. Yeah. But then like try yeah. listening to Tommy. I'm like, damn, this is boring without any cool visuals of like Elton John and. Like ten feet, fucking boots playing pinball. You know, it's a cool, uh, um, a cool Who song. Huh. Boris the Spider. You play Boris the Spider. I heard it. Good song. I, they got tracks. No I don't know if I can recall any music. No one, no one. I don't. I think you, you even, even a, a hater such as yourself. I can't even remember. Honestly, like I just remember. No, I know what you're saying. As a drummer, you get told that Keith Moon's really cool, and then I try listening to it. I'm like, yo, I cannot do this. <laughs> Sorry, feel, everyone. I feel like for record store guys, it should be like, hey, what's a band that everyone else likes that you also like? <laughs> like you have to say, like, what's a popular band that you like as a dickhead record store clerk? Uh -huh. <laughs> That's the funnier one. It's like, yeah, I think we're just naturally contrarians at some point. It's like, oh... <laughs> like that. Oh, yeah. that's that's cute. Yeah. You know, we're we're a pretentious breed. Oh, okay. So it's just like, you know, Fair. actually, hey, this is crazy. I know, but actually, I enjoy some Beatles. I'm say it. I'll say it. I yeah. know it's crazy. <laughs> I do love the Beatles. And that's where I'm like, I don't know. I can't do them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I think like for you know, such a we're like I said, we're contrarian so Yes. Hard. Yes. Rare to to be in line. So you could fill a fill a whole episode of just hating on stuff, but <laughs> That would be a waste of everyone's time, I think. Yeah. But if you have any questions you would like to see answered in next week's video, why don't you leave a comment in the YouTube comment section? We'll hit them up there. And hey, how about this? How about this? Let's turn it around at them, huh? What are some bands that you hate that everyone likes? And we'll we'll judge you very harshly on it. We do have somewhat of pop sensibilities. Mm -hmm. you can't just go off about enjoying Jack Johnson and Badfinger and pretend that we're 
yeah <laughs> about pop music so tell us the bands that you think are are, are uh, overrated or what have you we'll, we'll talk about it next week there we go point of discussion anyways thanks for watching everyone peace It's moderately lit. Yeah.